JWST has been featured in the press numerous times, and many people are excited to see what the final image will look like. Welcome to our investigation into the truth underlying the long-awaited James Webb Telescope photos. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, was launched into space by a European Ariane 5 rocket on Christmas Day 2021, after a 25-year journey at a cost of more than $10 billion. Webb had to be folded up to fit in the rocket's fairing, with its 6.5-meter mirror surface and tennis court-sized sunshield, and was only deployed step-by-step step in the first two weeks of its mission. The latest image from the James Webb Space Telescope gives an incredible perspective of the Milky Way satellite galaxy, the Large Magellanic Cloud. JWST's coldest instrument, the Mid-Infrared Instrument, or MIRI, was used to capture the image. Web scientists will be able to test the telescope's imaging capabilities by focusing on the star field of the Large Magellanic Cloud. NASA has released a set of photos comparing the capabilities of the James Webb Space Telescope with the Spitzer Space Telescope. Spitzer, the now-defunct observatory, took high-resolution near- and mid-infrared photographs of the universe. With its substantially larger primary mirror and upgraded detectors, Webb will allow us to observe the infrared sky with greater clarity, allowing us to make even more discoveries, NASA said in a statement. The James Webb Space Telescope has moved another step closer to starting science operations in the summer of 2022. On March 11th, NASA completed focusing the James Webb Space Telescope's primary mirror, attaining an accuracy that exceeded the initial objective and resulting in an image of star 2 mass, which was revealed on March 16, 2022. The image was noteworthy because it demonstrated that each of JWST's 18 primary mirror segments had been precisely aligned, resulting in the Space Telescope's famous honeycomb mirror shape. JWST had gone another step closer to embarking on its cosmic journey. The achievement signified the completion of a process known as fine phasing. The main mirror of the JWST is made up of 18 hexagonal segments. To focus them, the researchers focus the telescope at a lonely star with few nearby partners. Then they modified each panel so that when the 18 individual images were combined, they formed a single point of light that was concentrated to within 50 nanometers of the wavelength of infrared light it would see. The researchers then used the near-infrared camera to photograph the star. Even though the telescope was only supposed to pick up the targeted star, it also picked up a scattering of background galaxies. Now the fact is, we're all waiting for the James Webb Space Telescope to take the first proper photos of space, which should happen in June or early July 2022. In February 2022, the JWST team released an image of 18 strange stars spread across a black background. In actuality, the image captured a single bright star designated as HD 84406 in the constellation Ursa Major. Because JWST's mirror segments were still being positioned, the star was visible in 18 distinct positions. This ostensibly chaotic capture was caused by JWST's misaligned mirror segments bouncing light back into the telescope's detectors, and it was an important step of preparing Webb to produce stunning views of the universe. We've oriented and focused the telescope on a star, and the results are exceeding expectations. Ritva Keski Kua JWST's Deputy Optical Telescope Element Manager adds. The JWST team set out to build the most powerful telescope anyone has ever mounted in space more than 20 years ago, and they came up with an optical design to achieve the science goals, says Thomas Zerbican, Associate Administrator for NASA's Science Mission Directorate. The first in-focus image from one of JWST's cameras is tantalizing, promising future riches to astronomers. Webb's view shows sharply concentrated galaxies that indicate structure, even in these far background sources, in contrast to the earlier infrared image of the region from the Spitzer Satellite Telescope and the WISE Telescope, which revealed an array of blobs. We can piece together the life biographies of these hidden galaxies because to JWST's remarkable resolution. We know the camera scanned the field through several filters, even though we only have access to this single image. 
looking at the brightness of a galaxy in each of them would allow us to make an educated judgment of its distance, and so how far back in history of the universe we are viewing. That isn't the aim of these photographs, as more are on the way, but it is a tempting thought. What is the current status of the James Webb Space Telescope, and when will science operations begin? The massive space telescope was successfully positioned in a slow looping orbit around the second Lagrange point, L2, a stable gravitational location 1.5 million kilometers beyond Earth as seen from the Sun, after three mid-course correction maneuvers. However, there is still a lot more work to be done before we can begin science operations, says Mark McCoffrey, Senior Advisor for Science and Exploration at ESA, European Space Agency, NASA's principal partner in the mission. For one thing, the telescope and its sensitive sensors must cool to 230 degrees below zero after leaving the French Guiana launch site at tropical temperatures. JWST has already reached minus 200 degrees Celsius by early January 2022, thanks to its massive multi-layer sunshield, although the passive cooling is slowing down. According to McCoffrey, it's a sensitive process. The optics must never be the coldest part of the telescope, lest molecules released as gases from the graphite composite support structure freeze on the mirrors, causing the telescope's performance to suffer. The process of aligning the telescope's 18 mirror segments could finally begin after the near-cam equipment, near-infrared camera, got cool enough for its sensitive mercury-cadmium telluride detectors to pick up infrared light. Each hexagonal section has seven actuators and can be tilted, moved, rotated and deformed slightly to guarantee that they operate as one perfect parabolic surface. The image also serves as JWST's first light as the alignment procedure is carried out with starlight. However, bringing the 18 separate stellar images from each mirror into one single focus will take months of gradual precision changes. Engineers will begin commissioning JWST's four large instruments in late April 2022. Near-infrared camera, near-infrared spectrometer, mid-infrared instrument, and mid-infrared instrument, near-infrared imager, and slitless spectrograph. All of the viewing modes, which are equipped with beam splitters, filters, and micro-shutters, must be thoroughly verified and calibrated before being released to the astronomy community. Of course, every instrument has been tested and examined on Earth, McCoffrey says, but we need to verify that they work flawlessly in space as well. When will the first photographs from the James Webb Space Telescope be released? So what about the James Webb Space Telescope's purportedly awe-inspiring first image? The first photographs from JWST aren't scheduled for another six months after launch, in late June or early July 2022. It's a well-guarded secret that it will reveal. It's most certainly a star-forming area, McCoffrey agrees. The first wave of scientific observations will not begin until the summer of 2022. Astronomers are eager to use their new, pricey toy on their favorite objects, whether it's a distant galaxy from the dawn of time, a planet spawning a crescent disk, an exoplanet's atmosphere, or a creature from our own solar system. The pointing flexibility of the James Webb Space Telescope is smaller than that of the Hubble Space Telescope. Because the telescope must face away from the sun to keep its instruments cool, its field of sight will cover 40% of the sky on any given day, and accessing the entire sky will take about six months. JWST's mid-course corrections consumed less fuel than projected, indicating that there is still enough fuel to sustain the space telescope in its L2 orbit. As a result, its operational lifetime could be prolonged by the 10-year time frame originally planned. How the James Webb Space Telescope Unfolded in Space? Here is the timeline of the James Webb Space Telescope. JWST reached its orbital position and became completely deployed after more than 50 separate steps and two weeks. Here's how it all happened in chronological order. December 25, 2021 at 12.20 UT. JWST launches from the Guiana Space Center aboard an Ariane 5 rocket. After 27 minutes, it separates from the launcher's upper stage and travels to L2 on its own. December 25, 2021 at 12.48 UT JWST 6-meter, 5-panel solar array, which delivers around 1 kilowatt of power, was deployed. The telescope can now run on its own power, rather than relying on batteries. December 26, 2021 
deployment of the high-gain communications antenna, which allows connection with Earth via NASA's Deep Space Network. December 28, 2021 The forward unitized pallet structure, UPS, was lowered into place to support and confine the five folded layers that make up the front half of the sunshield. December 29, 2021 the deployable tower assembly, DTA, is raised by 1.2 meters for better thermal isolation and to allow the sun shield to unfold in front and behind it. 30th to the 31st of December, 2021. Sun shield mid booms are extended on either side, pulling the folded sun shield layers with them to form the first part of its distinctive 21 meters by 14 meter kite shape. 3rd to the 4th of January, 2022. Web Sunshield's five captain layers are tensioned. The protected side will be as chilly as minus 230 degrees Celsius, while the sun-facing side will be up to 90 degrees Celsius. JWST's 74-centimeter convex secondary mirror was deployed on January 5, 2022. It's been termed the world's most complex tripod because of the folding construction that supports it. On January 6, 2022, the 1.2 meter by 2.4 meter AFT deployable instrument radiator, or ADIR, which vents heat from the Space Telescope Science Instruments into space, is launched. 7th to the 8th of January 2022, the two side panels that make up JWST's 6.5 meter primary mirror are deployed. Its 18 hexagonal pieces are constructed of beryllium that has been plated in pure gold. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to stay here for more JWST updates.